very meh. It's like the prettiest, most perfect pink. Please fit. Oh, it fits. Guys, it's so soft. Go husband, go husband. Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to a new vlog. It is 10.50, I'm starting this vlog on the later side, but it is Thursday, so no gym today. Just gonna take it chill. I think I've mentioned this, but like, I have my period right now and I'm just like, mm, no. Feeling very meh, very meh. Hi, Bruni. Um, I'm really excited though, cause we just got uh, a really good quote for a fence because We've been wanting to get a fence. We just didn't know when we were gonna do it. But now with Bruno, we just really want him to be able to zoom, zoom, zoom around town. Bruno loves to run. <laughs> so we have like, we have like a runner for him right now, you know, that like clips on and he can run, but like, it's just, it's just not the same. And we have like a pretty wide backyard. So for him to be able to like zoom around and like just play fetch freely, um, it's gonna be easier for him to go to the bathroom. Um, because I feel like we are just always walking him. So it's like, it's just gonna be really, really nice. We're still gonna walk him and stuff, but it's gonna be fun for him to just like have the ability to roam around. So um, probably within the next few months, we'll be able to get that in time for like spring. And it's gonna be so fun. It's gonna be so fun. He's just smiling at me. He's like, yeah. <laughs> so it makes me really happy. Um, I'm wearing my little uh, set from Buff Bunny. It's like, <laughs> Why don't I just move the camera? This lounge set from Buff Bunny is so comfy and it has like this like Buff Bunny embroidered logo. It's so soft, like the best material. I have been very into Buff Bunny lately, like very much into their quality. Um, and I love like a matching set. So I will link. And if you want anything from Buff Bunny, my discount code is fearless. Their stuff is so cute and they go up to 3x so i'm contemplating going to get my nails done it's been over two weeks they're very grown out and like they're at the point where they're starting to get long um but they were really pretty this like long red almondy shape i get between almond and oval and these are my natural nails with the uv gel it's been a very long time since i've done anything very neutral i was thinking about going back to like just like a kind of creamy, milky pink vibe to something neutral. But then I was also like, should I get my Valentine's nails? But I also, <laughs> I know this is just, this is what goes on in my brain. I'm like, do I really wanna sit there for a long time and get designs? Because as much as I love it, I just like, it's like an extra almost hour sometimes, maybe a half hour getting like designs on your nails. And I just don't have the patience. Also, I took yesterday off from vlogging and I went to the dollar store, the Dollar Tree, and I like got some really good stuff. I should have vlogged, but like I was kind of just not in the mood to vlog yesterday. Um, we needed like gardening gloves because we have like trash in the woods in our backyard and we need to go pick it up. So we wanted to like get some gloves, a dollar a pop. Well, a dollar twenty-five. Dollar Tree is now a dollar twenty-five. And I needed a comb. I don't have a comb. <laughs> Like I only have hair brushes, so I got this really cute kind of tortoise shell print comb for like parting the hair. Um, it's just good to have a comb. I really just needed one. And look at this cute hair clip. It's a butterfly with pearls. So, so cute. I don't know, certain things you can get at the Dollar Tree that are at Target for a dollar. From Pixie. It's the Clarity Collection, which we need because I don't pick that up. <laughs> Anything that falls on the floor, Bruno will pick up. <laughs> okay, we need this because like I have been breaking out lately. So we have the Clarity Cleanser, salicylic acid with probiotics. Then it has a toner. Ooh, a Clarity Concentrate. Natural, problem-solving active ingredients, refines and replenishes skin to improve texture and resilience. Then we have a lotion, which is an oil-free moisturizer. I like this like kind of aluminum packaging. And then a zero zit gel for pimples. Okay, obsessed. And I love this like blue packaging. So cute. Okay, so I actually need to restock my pills. So these are my calcium chews for bariatric surgery. Then we've got the Prozac. Um, I take stool softener because since my surgery, I just need it. So I take some of these every night. Um, it's fine with my doctor. And then these are the bariatric prenatals since we're trying to get pregnant. That's what my doctor recommended. 
Um, so this is the little three a day container I use. So I've showed this before. I have this from Amazon. It's like my tried and true. I've had it for over a year now. Um, so it's perfect and it fits the calcium chews, which is everything. So let's uh, fill up our daily vitamins. They fit everything perfectly. It's awesome. So if I'm like traveling or going anywhere, I can just um, carry these with me. It's truly just like so helpful. Say goodbye to the pretty red. It's hard because like they still look good, but they're just getting so long. And like when I look at them, they're really grown out. So it's probably just time to go. So let's go. Okay, you guys, I just got my nails done. I am at a stoplight. I got this really pretty pinky color. Um, I've seen a lot of people do this, but I recently saw Emily do it with um, two coats of funny bunny and then one coat of bubble bath both from opi and it's like the prettiest most perfect pink like it's so pretty i love it i love it so uh now we're gonna head home and do some organizing in the downstairs bathroom closet okay so i'm in my downstairs bathroom um yar is working out behind you in the garage so you might be able to hear it so this is the downstairs bathroom closet it's kind of a mess so i had some extra old containers from Target upstairs that I'm not using so I mean honestly even most of this stuff like I do want to keep down here so it's just a matter I think of organizing it and putting it in baskets that really just makes all the difference and those containers are super cheap I'll see if they still have them at Target and link them you can see if they have them at your store so I like to keep a bath towel down here in case Bruno's playing in like you know water or if it's raining it's just, you'd be surprised how much it's nice to have one of these down here. We have our favorite tissues. We love the Vicks tissues. Y'all know. We've got a stray tissue box that's not Vicks, just the plus lotion. So let's see. Okay, so it looks like we can either fit like one large basket or maybe we can fit two of the small. I'm pretty sure I have more of the small upstairs. Actually, I think we can fit three. Please fit. Oh, it fits. Oh my gosh. Yes. I wish. No. No. Okay. So like just, ugh, see, it just already makes things look better. So we've got a bunch of excess soaps right here, like leftover hand soaps. So I'm going to put these here. These are a great Amazon find. Look how like aesthetic they are. They're really nice hand soaps um, and they're a good price. So I will link those if you want like an aesthetic soap to put out, but it's like really good. I'm keeping this pumpkin chai one from Nest for the fall. <laughs> I've got a Myers soap. You just gotta have soap ready to go. And I also have some L'Occitane hand lotion. L'Occitane. I recently learned I've been saying it wrong. It's L'Occitane. I used to call it L'Occitane. <laughs> All right, this is excess hair cutting equipment that I really don't use so we're gonna put that look at the scissors sticking out of it oh my god I gave my friend a haircut the other day I wish I vlogged it because her hair looked so good like I was like okay I still got it because I cut Yar's hair but like doing a girl haircut Bruno has something what do you have oh it's you <laughs> oh my god I was like no not really yeah it was just Yarman. I thought, I thought Bruno got into something. Okay, so we have a bunch of masks as well. So I've got black ones. What is this? Oh, this is a face mask as well. So we've got black ones, a bunch of regular blue ones. I'm gonna run up and see if I have more. I'm pretty sure I do. Um, so yeah, put stuff that you don't need often at the top. Best tip. I can tell ya. And we've got like an old candle here. And we have an extra lighter in here. 
because sometimes sometimes I light a candle in the bathroom when we have like company over because I just think it's really cozy. I don't know if that's weird. Let me run upstairs and get more baskets. All right, two more baskets right here. They fit perfectly. And then I have one more row down here, which I might do a big organizer on again. Okay, I have another lotion. So I'm gonna put lotions in this one next to the soap. I have our fabric shaver for anything that pills. I'm gonna put that here. I keep a heating pad down here for when Aunt Flo comes to town. I'm gonna put that one up here as well, just cause we don't use it all that often. Actually, I might put it like next to it. I think I'll put the tissues down here. Do one more like big one right here. Just because like tissues are kind of big. Or put them on the side. No, I'm gonna put them in. <laughs> this is just me thinking out loud. Okay, and here is the finished product. So much better. So again, I've got miscellaneous hair stuff up here that we don't use often. Heated blanket, well, heating pad. <laughs> extra soap, extra lotion, our fabric deep pillar. I don't know why I'm drawing a blank. Extra face masks, wipes. This has room for the future. Extra tissues on each side of this. That is my hair bag that has all of my stuff to cut Yar's hair, so it's just easy to take out. And then extra toilet paper and a big one down here. So... Isn't it funny how just like putting things in bins makes such a difference? Okay, I'm so excited. I just got in this blanket I ordered like a hot minute ago from Amazon uh, and it's so pretty. So I'm going to take it out and go wash it because I definitely want to use it tonight when we watch our show. Oh, we started The Dropout on Hulu with Amanda Seyfried. Um, it's based on that true story with Elizabeth Holmes. It's really good. So I got this huge, oh my gosh, guys, this feels like my Barefoot Dreams blanket. Um, it's a huge checkered blanket. It's with just like these pretty beigey squares and it's like a jumbo size. So it can definitely fit. Yeah, it's, um, oh, this is in centimeters, 150 by 200 centimeters, but it's really, really long. Guys, it's so soft. <laughs> This is an amazing dupe for the Barefoot Dreams blanket because I do have one from Barefoot Dreams. They're like kind of expensive. This one feels the same, oh my gosh. But like I've seen a lot of people with these checkered blankets but they were not like big enough. This one is way bigger so I will link it. It's so soft, I'm gonna go wash it. I'm obsessed, I love this color, love the checkered, love the oversized, and it's so soft. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy with this because I was a little nervous but it's perfect and it's like heavy. It's like good quality. Okay, so it's about four o'clock. I just took my makeup off. The sun is starting to set. I just want to be comfy. I got some new glasses um, as well. These are from Zenny. They're super affordable. And like, I always go for like big glasses since I have a round, um, pretty wide face and they look so good. Like, I love these, not to toot my own horn. I just like the way these glasses look on me. Um, they got the tortoiseshell, uh, gold arms. So I'll link these cause I always get asked what my glasses, the ones I typically wear are black, um, little cat eye. They're from Fendi. I think I got them from like glasses USA or something like that. I don't even know, but one of my tried and true sites is Zenny. I have glasses from Zenny and Warby Parker. Those are like my pretty much two go-tos. And then I randomly bought those Fendi ones online, but yeah, these are the new glasses. I really like them. So I'm gonna go get some work done on the computer before we cook dinner. Many hours later. Okay, so for dinner tonight, I'm gonna make some baked chicken, corn, and some collie mash. So I'm gonna do, I'm not gonna do all this chicken. This is just my chicken that I keep in the fridge. It's like I get the big pack, put it in here for the week. So I'm basically gonna just like put some seasoning with the panko. Um, do a little olive oil on like some chicken. I'm just gonna kind of cut it into like tenderly kind of strips um, and then dip it in the panko and seasoning with a little olive oil so it will stick. And then I'm gonna bake it on 425 for 10 minutes, then flip it, 10 more minutes, bada bing, bada boom. That's the plan, let's do it.
Hey you guys. Okay, it is so much later now. It is 8.30. We just watched the third episode. Ooh, I got a sneeze, I got a sneeze. It went away. Oh, I hate that. Do you wanna say hello? We just took our night pee and poop walk and you were a good boy, you went poo poo outside. Okay, so we just watched another episode of The Dropout and we had dinner. I never showed you guys the footage of the baked chicken, but oh my gosh. It was perfect. It was juicy on the inside, really crispy on the outside. I also, when I flipped them, I sprayed a little like avocado oil cooking spray on top. Crispy, delish. It was really, really good. Highly recommend. Okay, so really funny. I don't really like going out at night. It's just me. I, I'm, I'm a homebody anyway, but at night, I just... I just want to be at home because I peruse throughout the day. I run my errands, whatever. But Yar is just stuck at home working all day. Like he works from home. He's just home. So at night he's like, I just want to like go for a ride. Do we need to go to Target? Do we need me to go get gas for you? Like he just like wants to get out. So I was like, I was like, there's this foundation at Ulta that I really want to try. If you want to like go pick it up for me, like it's in stock at our Ulta. Because it reminded me, because I saw a TikTok, I know, forever influenced by TikTok. And I love it. So <laughs> it was in stock there, and I was like, do you want to go try to pick it up? He's like, can you place it as an order, and I'll pick it up. I'm like, they close at 9, it's 8.30, like, you're going to have to go in and find it. And he's like, I'm up for the challenge. I was like, yeah, just like FaceTime me when you're there, and we'll go find it. So it's, um, see, like, I'm literally an old lady <laughs> going out at 8.30. No. So yeah, it was like FaceTime me when you get there. It's the Maybelline Superstay powder. Like it looked really, really good. And like I used to love a good old just powder foundation because they take like no time to apply. Um, the most recent one I've liked, because I don't really use them all that often, it's the Makeup Forever one. It's like a matte one. Those are really good. So I want to see how it compares. But this has like really good reviews. I've seen so many people try it on TikTok. It's like out of stock online but they had it in our store so i'm gonna see what shades they have i think it said they had shade 220 in the store wait no not 220 120 120 looked good but like you just never know if they're gonna have it like actually in the store it says it does but sometimes they don't but it's a 24 hour wear weightless feel matte look powder and like the coverage like people do a swipe and it's just crazy so i'm just like casually waiting for him to get there and facetime me he does get husband of the year award though because like i know like when i'm pregnant and there's like a midnight craving for pickles or something i know that sounds very cliche but i know he will go he will go is it the maybelline super setting powder is he already there Super stay. Okay, let me send him a screenshot. I can't believe he's doing this for me right now. <laughs> I need to know what shades they have in stock. Oh, okay. He's FaceTiming me. Is it dead in there? Lost. You're lost. So I'm trying to think. Can you show me what you... Can you flip the camera? Oh, nope. You got to go to the other side. You're on the bougie side. What? I'm looking for setting powder. Maybelline, it's just try to find Maybelline. Nope, go, go towards the front of the store. That's where the makeup is. You're near oh, the hair stuff. Gosh, yep. I'm looking for Maybelline setting powder. Yeah, I found somebody. FaceTime my wife. <laughs> the Maybelline Super Stay powder. Super Stay powder, yeah, and the Super Stay. Yeah, yeah I'm in the Maybelline section here. Oh, right here, the Super Stay powder. Okay, yep. Yeah. Uh, I'm, I'll just show her and then there it is, there it is. But thank you. Yes. Okay. Those are them. I see them. Um, can you show me all the colors? That that is nowhere near my color. Do you have? Do they have? This one? No. Is, do they have lighter ones? No. This one. Three twelve. No. No one hundreds. No. I thought you just showed me one thirty. I didn't. Oh yeah, I have one thirty. 130. What is it called? Does it have a name on it? Wait, I have 128. 128? Yeah. Let me see it. Okay. Let's try that one. That's the lightest one they have. Yeah. Where are you usually? I was hoping to get 120, but I might be able to make the 128 yeah, work. Yeah, 128. All right. Screw yeah. it. Let's try it. 
I mean, they have, they have not powder. They have, I guess, it's something else. Yeah, no, I want to try the powder, but thank you. No, 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 no. There's more over here. Oh, there's a bunch. <gasps> Amazing. Oh, yeah. What? 118. Oh, yeah, let me see the 118. Yeah, that's not what I just want to see, unfortunately. No, 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 118 should be perfect. You sure? Yeah. Because you were looking for 120, right? Yeah, but that that seems good. Okay. Cool. All right, yeah, that sounds good. Yeah, this is the only one I see. Yay, success. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Oh my god, yeah, he was looking at the top. They had it like on display because it's like really popular right now. And then he looked down and they had a bunch at the bottom. Yes. Go husband, go husband. Okay, pretty exciting. I also just heard the dryer go off. So I think my checkered blanket is finally dry because like it held so much water when it was washed. So I was like, okay, you know when that happens and it's just like something's still soaking wet because it's so absorbent and then you have to like do the spinny cycle a million times. Hey you guys, it's the next morning. Um, okay, so hectic morning. <laughs> hectic morning it's friday i went to the gym already um i filmed a little mini vlog this morning for reels i just like could not wake up today but let's get ready to go to the gym mm. i can't see a thing pause to read Heated up egg bites I made the other day. Water and Alani. Today is a total body day, so let's do it. I'll record what I can if the gym isn't busy. Had a great workout. Next stop, the Dollar Tree. I need a new sponge. Valentine's stuff already. Oh my god, it's all so cute. How do I resist all of this? Oh my god. Look how cute this is. I've gotta stay focused. Good, how are you? Next up, I'm gonna go get my husband's favorite bread at a bakery. Um, I forgot to take a clip last night, but Yarman did in fact get an awesome shade like it looks perfect so we're gonna try that today but um we just got a call from the people who did our backsplash i think because our house is just like settling the grout is all cracked so they're gonna come fix it and the guy could like randomly come now we've been trying to get him to come here so the fact that they have availability now we're like okay yeah just come so i'm cleaning taking everything off of the counters so they can do the grout fixing um and then i also have a meeting <laughs> 10 minutes on the phone so i'm like why am i vlogging i don't know um but i'm really like hoping this guy comes right before my meeting starts just so i can let him in and then i can skedaddle upstairs but anyway i ended up baking cookies last night for um my cousin's birthday this weekend and then it hit me i'm like why am i making these days in advance <laughs> So I don't know if I should put them in the freezer. I mean, it's only a couple days, right? But yeah, like see how it's all cracked. I guess that happens with like new construction and the house settling, so it'll be nice to get that fixed. Okay, so everything worked out perfectly. The grout guy came right before my appointment on the phone, which was perfect. So he did that. I took my call, the grout is fixed all back to normal so it's one o'clock and i decided to book myself a blowout appointment at dry bar because yar got me that gift card for christmas so it's one o'clock i made an appointment for 1 30 because they had 1 30 or like three y'all know how i feel about going out in the afternoon in the winter anyway so i'm gonna go take a quick body shower it's only like 10 minutes away so i can definitely leave here in 20 minutes but i'm really excited because we have um a really fun busy weekend come on bruni so it'll be nice to have a blowout for the weekend okay i took the world's quickest shower i washed my body threw my hair up in a clip and i just threw on a little mascara concealer and brow gel and then my outfit is these abercrombie jeans 
I got this cute not today cupid with like little cupids on it it's from living fully uh, I think they're sold out now of the Valentine's Day collection but it's like so cute okay I'm gonna go make my hair pretty <laughs> I'll be back in a little while guys it's so pretty i got beach waves because i wanted to like see how they'd come out with someone else doing them but they look so pretty um yeah really nice because like i can do my hair at home of course but like it is so nice to like get it done by someone sometimes so um yeah yar i think i already said that yar had got me a gift card for christmas and i actually have enough to get another blowout another time so um i also got beach waves too because this is gonna last me like all weekend when i do like beach waves it just lasts so long and we have a birthday party we have two birthday parties this weekend and dinner with some friends that are coming in from out of town so we're gonna be really busy this weekend so i'm gonna let these curls really 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 set and i can just like touch them up the next few days so cute she did great mm -hmm. 